Hey everyone, it's Alyssa from JNL Mom. I went to Aldi today, so I thought I'd show you what I got. Um, I got this um, peanut butter toast crackers for the kids. We're actually going camping this weekend at my dad's trailer. So I picked up mostly snack items and things that we would need for this weekend. So I got this because the kids like that. I got, I actually got two of these, a big pack of these six pack of raisins because I've said it before, my kids love them and I just, if I see them for a good deal, I'm going to grab them. Um, I know buying bigger containers of raisins is more eco-friendly and more cost effective, but these are great for when we're out and about. My kids always want snacks and they typically ask for raisins for snacks. So I feel like those are healthy snacks, so I always grab them. I got these 100 pack whole almonds snack packs for me or the kids or my husband. I thought these would be a good snack for me. I've been eating kind of bad lately, so I was hoping these would be a good snack replacement for something bad. I got a bunch of these for the kids. They're just the squeezy pouches. Again, not eco-friendly at all, but my kids like them when we're out and about, so I get what they like. I got an apple multi-fruit. I actually got two of these. I got an apple and peach, and then I also got two of the regular applesauce. The other stuff is already put away. This is just the stuff I kept out for camping. I got a box of these mini muffins chocolate chip as a treat for the kids, and we already dipped into them, so it was a five pack, and now there's three left, so. I also got some veggie straws. We really like these. All of us do. I got some fresh packed um, half sour pickles. I just thought these looked tasty. Me and Jeremy love pickles. I got a big thing of juice for vacation. Uh, I typically give the kids um, super, super, super watered down apple juice, like 97% water and a splash of apple juice in their cups. Um, I probably could skip doing this, but I think it's kind of just habit now, so we'll have that. I also found these really cool small stacking baskets, and I got three of them, and they're pretty big. Um, they're just white wire stacking baskets, and I'm going to use these under my sink for some you know, toiletry organization, and I can do a video on that because it would probably, hopefully, fingers crossed, be a good before and after because my under my sink is just a disaster. I have too many things um, all just in a huge large square or rectangle bin and it's just it's a mess like my husband was looking for a band-aid for me yesterday and he couldn't find any um, and then I started rifling around and there's like four boxes of them so it's just out of control so these were $3.99 each so for a 12 12 dollars for that i thought that was pretty good i mean i'm not sure i didn't really shop around i just saw them and i thought that would work for an area i have in mind that i need to organize so i grabbed them hopefully i can do a video on how they turn out in my bathroom lastly i got bread i don't know about you guys but aldi has great prices on bread this loaf was a dollar 49 and i ended up getting six of them and they are already in my freezer um, because we can't eat, you know, six loaves of bread before they would go bad. So I just thought this, um, was good. It says no high fructose corn syrup and no artificial flavors. So, and it's a wheat. I thought the kids would like it. We eat sandwiches constantly and I knew I could freeze them. So I got this and five others, which are in the freezer already. That's, I believe that's all I got at Aldi. Um, like I said, a couple more boxes of those that are already put away, a box of those already put away, and I think, and the bread, and then these, and I think that was it, and I spent, it was less than $50, I believe 42 or 43 So that's my Aldi haul. I don't go there often, but, because it's far away, but I'm reminded again, now that I've went, how great the prices are and, and the good stuff you can buy. I think I missed this. I got these um, brioche buns. These were a little more expensive. It was like $2.99 for these or something, but they just looked so delicious. And I think I'm going to make meatball subs with these today, even though these aren't the typical sub rolls. I just thought I could slice little, like, pickle size, and the meatballs, like, pickle size, and just load them in there or do, like, tuna sandwiches for supper tonight because it's so hot and it sounds like that would be good. And they just looked so tasty. Um, so I also got those, but again, I'm reminded when I went how great Aldi is and the prices like this bread, $1.50, $1.49, that's insane. So 
anyway, that's my haul. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye!